more than two or three in that race for the number one position. In the this is the Bucking Bull of the Year in 1992. Kansas City is the place. Charlie Sampson is the main man in tune. I'm on the ranch of Charles Sampson, 2019 Hall of Fame bull riding champion. Four championships, 1982 world record. He's a black cowboy. I didn't even know he existed until now. Me and Charles is about to draw something and we're gonna have a nice conversation. You was just inducted to the Hall of Fame this year. I was inducted into the Bull Riding Hall of Fame uh, in May of okay. 2019. Right. When you first started out, would you ever imagine that you could be a world bull riding champion? You were a black cowboy that won a world championship. I, I didn't even know that we even had any black cowboys that were riding bulls. I just, I mean, I might be, I might be ignorant. You know, because I didn't know that existed. So what makes that color special? I mean, is it history there or something? Well, for me, right. I, I wore black hats, I wore brown hats. Right. I said, Charlie, right. you're a good guy. Right. Good guys wear white hats. Bad guys <laughs> wear black hats. Gotcha. <laughs> but gotcha. it's, it's a preference. And what you doing in prison, you're a nice guy. I was convicted you need of a wear, crime I didn't commit. You need a, which, which you had a black of, hat on? I had a black hat on <laughs> and I ended up in prison. <laughs> wow. So I've never ridden a horse. Okay, mm -hmm. maybe one day you can teach me how to ride one. The key to riding a horse is body position. So okay. that's what I learned at a at an early age. And the whole key is is to be centered and and guiding to go this way, go right. that way. And if you want to slow him down, then you go back. Did you face any type of discrimination being a black cowboy? Was it? I mean, what kind of challenges did you face? Uh, the bulls that I got on was right. my biggest challenge. Wow. The bulls that I got on didn't know right. if I was right. black or white or right. from Los Angeles or from Texas. Oh, see, I'm 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 assuming that the cowboys that you were around were all white and that you were the only black guy, like almost like the Rat Pack with Sammy Davis Jr. Now I rode a lot of bulls. Right. I don't know about drawing. Yeah, we're gonna draw a bull today. So everybody, get out your pencils and your paper because y'all gonna draw along with us. Put your ears in. Requirement. I'm holding on and I'm like this. What if I touch myself or touch the bull? What does that mean? The requirement in bull riding is that you ride a bull with one hand. Right. Your hand in the air is for balance. Doesn't matter if it's his fault or the bull fault. Right. You cannot touch that animal gotcha. in that eight second ride. Did you ever communicate with a bull in your mind? Mind, you know what I mean? This bull is yeah. communicating with each other. He's gonna do the right thing here. You know, hey, I need right. you to right. buck, <laughs> but not buck me off. National Finals Rodeo, Las Vegas Championship, I can ride him. Right. He just shot out of there, right. turned, and I was like, what the world are you thinking? Right. <laughs> off I went. So how long does a bull anticipate before he's retired or her? Is it a he? Is it a, is it a him and a her? Or <laughs> it was just male bulls? It's mostly male bulls. It's a male-dominated uh, okay. competition. Uh, don't you think that's discriminatory towards women? Well, women bulls? I mean, they can ride certain bulls. Right. But you're, I think you better be careful. Well, that's what I'm trying to be careful. You're, right. trying to, you're trying to get 2019, both get, of us going to be in well, trouble. That's, uh, women can be bull riders. Right. I believe there's one out there. Now, what's the name of that bull that, that you said that gave you the difficult, what was the name of it again? Pacific Bell. Yeah, would you like to eat Pacific Bell? Black Cowboys. But you gotta draw and talk, though. Okay. Gotta, gotta, I can hear you. <laughs> oh, you can hear me right, talk. You gotta about... draw and talk. You gotta, okay. you gotta color all them ears in. Oh, and man, I can do a lot yeah, of work it. here. When you get on that bull, it's gonna be me showing you how to do it right. Right. Oh wait, wait, wait. And hold on, me, wait, wait. Me showing you're not getting on no bull. Me showing you how to ride a horse bull with one Maybe hand. Maybe a horse. Me not getting on no bull. Maybe a horse now. He put me on a baby bull like 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 maybe six months old, maybe no, three months too, old. You, a baby bull is a baby bull. Okay, you too okay. you too heavy for a baby bull. Well, that's why I'm starting. I with need the baby to put bull. you on a two thousand oh, pound bull. No, no, I need. <laughs> okay, so check this out. I'm not going to let you off the hook. So okay. you, we got to get to sketching. Okay, we got to get well, that bull right. done. What do I
So make sure you go from dark to light. The edges should be darker. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Wow. What put part? your hand. Put your hand in there, <laughs> and put the rope around the, the calf leg. Leg, and help you know the, get the calf. You know what? Out. First of all, we don't have a clue as to what women go through when they're giving birth. You so, know, like I know I know this is an animal, but I can't help but think about my mama and what she had to go through to, to get me out. So during your career, have you suffered any uh, serious injuries? Were you ever hospitalized? Professional rodeo had a bull step on my chest, wow. crushed my sternum bone, broke uh, two ribs, punctured a lung. Wow. You know, I had a bull break my leg four times, had a bull step on my head, knock my ear off. You know, we all have a journey and we all come from somewhere. People think that, you know, black cowboys are not for real. Right. And we are for real. Who knows I can show up at your doorstep? 